What's going on everyone and welcome back to a brand new Star Wars Jedi Survivor video. This is the first video about this game on this channel and I'm going to be doing many more so if you are interested in the game make sure to subscribe to be kept up to date with those. But in this video I'm going to be going over everything that you need to know about Star Wars Jedi Survivor that we know so far. So Star Wars Jedi Survivor is just one of the many Star Wars games in the works at EA in partnership with Lucasfilm Games and it's due for release in 2023. So Jedi Survivor will remain a single player action adventure game with a focus on lightsaber combat in the same way that Fallen Order did. We haven't seen any gameplay of Jedi Survivor yet but it's probably going to double down on what we got to play and see in Fallen Order. So in Fallen Order we left off with Cal managing to retrieve a holocron containing a list of four sensitive children. Realising that the list puts those in danger, Cal destroyed the holocron with the belief that they should be able to choose their own destinies. Jedi Survivor takes place five years after the events of Fallen Order and we don't know where Cal and the crew are or what they'll actually be doing and we don't really know what planets are going to be in the game yet. Jedi Survivor's reveal trailer features a voiceover of a pawn Imperial Senator asking why lead when they won't follow? Why fight when you can't win? What is your next move Jedi? It's at this point in the trailer Cal is seen fighting a mysterious Sith and dropping his lightsaber before the scene cuts back to the senator opening up a box containing Cal's lightsaber. Near the end of the trailer, Cal and BD-1 are seen looking into a back tank with an unknown person inside. Whoever this person is, they'll probably play an important role in the story, but we have no idea who that is at the moment. So far, only Cal and BD-1 have been confirmed to return to Jedi Survivor, but the crew of the Mantis may very well follow. In terms of gameplay, Jedi Survivor should be similar to its predecessor, Fallen Order, focusing on lightsaber combat and force abilities. Fallen Order emphasised timing and parries in combat with different attacks to inflict higher damage and break an enemy's guard. Jedi Survivor will likely have open levels, in a similar way to Fallen Order, that encourage exploration. And it's expected that Jedi Survivor will also bring back the puzzle solving aspect of Fallen Order. And if Jedi Survivor is anything like Fallen Order, which it seems like it's going to be, we should expect to face some brutally difficult bosses along the story. So Jedi Survivor, like I said, takes place five years after Jedi Fallen Order, which itself began five years after Order 66. So this does put the game in the same time frame that the Obi-Wan Kenobi series takes place. The game is fully canon within the Star Wars timeline, meaning elements of it could be referenced in upcoming movies or television series, or we could see those in the game. When it comes to the release date, Jedi Survivor is due out sometime in 2023 for Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, PlayStation 5 and PC. And it is expected that because of this, the experience should be streamlined and there should be a lot less loading times or shorter loading times when it comes to actually playing the game. And that is a quick roundup of everything that we know about Star Wars Jedi Survivor so far. It's not much, but all we do have to go on is the little reveal trailer that we got to see at Star Wars Celebration. But I'm hoping that as time goes by, we will get more news a bit more frequently than we have for previous games. So if you have enjoyed this video and you are looking forward to the game, make sure to smash a like on it and let me know down in the comment section what you hope to see in Jedi Survivor. And like I said, I'm going to be covering this game on the channel. So if you do want to stay up to date with it, make sure to subscribe to be kept up to date with anything that does come out related to the game. But other than that, we'll see you in the next video.